Hey guys, my name's Bola. Uh, you can call me Bola or from Bola Curve. I'm a relatively new YouTuber, and this is a new series that I'm going to be doing that teaches you guys how to ensure that you win in every single free for all game that you're ever going to play. Now, there are some important things here that you have to take into account while you're playing and a bunch of stuff, but we'll get to that later. The first map for this series is going to be Hijack. This is probably one of the biggest like maps that you'll ever, I say big, I mean this is one of the most popular maps that you'll ever do free for all on and right here we'll, you'll see me immediately pick up the first blood and what I did there is I know that someone's gonna spawn right next to me in like a really close proximity especially on this map uh, two people spawn on this side of the boat that I'm on and then you'll see that other people came back towards the back of the boat because that is a high kill area and so I just kind of hung around over there and waited for a few minutes and got a couple kills as y'all saw Okay, and then right here what I'm doing is I'm trying to decide if I want to go upstairs or downstairs because I'm going to remain over here uh, for a little bit to make sure that I've kind of dominated this area. That's what you're going to try and do in free for all. You want to have an area of the map that you want complete control over. And for me, I like to have one end of the boat at all times. And right here, you see me get killed. Uh, he saw me around the corner a little bit before I saw him. So we're going to continue on the other side of the boat. Now immediately I'm like, okay, I'm on this side of the boat now. This is my side of the boat. So I'm going to know that the spawn, I have one spawn behind me, and you'll see me in a few seconds here. After I get this kill, I'll probably run back in there and uh, check the back of the boat because I do know that people spawn. And you also, the area that I was just in, the lookouts over the middle, yeah, here you go, looking over at the spawn. They spawn behind that wall, just a heads up. That is a spawn point. And if you get far enough away, you can ensure that you can get a kill through that way. And right here I come up on a double double fight right here and end up taking out a guy. That's just one of those easy kills you get. But anyway, uh, you don't want to look out over the windows like the two are, that are on either side of the little courtyard area in the middle over here because those are really high like target areas. People look up there all the time. And then here we go. I'm back on the other side of the boat again. And unluckily, I get taken out by a second guy. That's just too unfortunate for me. And then I'm in the middle of the boat, and I know that I need to get out of the middle of the boat because it's a, that's not where you want to be because there's going to be people coming from all over uh, to try and kill you. And then we're back at the other side of the boat. Uh, this is the one with the wall spawn. And I'm, I, I personally like to stay in the upper floor. You'll see me. I'll check over here, and then I'll drop down. Don't stay up there too long. Now I'm going to look. It looks like I'm switching sides of the boat because the other side seems to have more action going on. Again, you want to pay attention to your map at all times because that's going to show you where the firefights are going on, where you can go clean up some kills. And it'll ensure that you are able to uh, have an advantage over that person because they've most likely been hit, and you can kill them quicker. All right, and here we go. Uh, I found a guy, and it turns out there was a little bit of action going on over here. Right here, I juke this dude out. He thinks I'm going around that way. I shoot a little bit. I don't know why he turns or doesn't turn around, but I get him, and then I head back up to the top of the boat, my favorite spot, calling my UAV, and luckily I find a camper up here he's in that window you don't ever want to go and hang out in that window that guy is just unlucky <laughs> alright and then dominating this side of the boat one more time uh, lightning strike now this is pretty good I go ahead and I'm pretty sure I, no I don't use that yet I know that there's somebody spawned back here no I don't no I don't I'm wrong I'm wrong alright so this guy he saw me back here that's what it was and then I have a sniper right here just laid down he's just trying to quick scope You're, those are going to be easy kills for you all the time and I get my stealth chopper now this is the Probably the best kill streak that you can get in free for all, in my opinion, because it doesn't require you to have to lay down anywhere. You can just call it in, and on top of that, most of the time in like team deathmatch and all the like all the team-based games in Call of Duty, you have to work as a team to take that thing down. Because as soon as it sees you, it's going to start shooting at you. And also, in addition to that, most people aren't going to be carrying around rocket launchers and uh, uh, strellas or whatever they're called in this game to take those things out. And what I do is I just put that right on the middle of the map, and as you can see, it's already gotten me two kills at this point. And I'm just going, switching sides of the boat, because you don't want to get stuck on one side, because that kind of makes people not want to go over there, because they just keep dying when they go over there, obviously, if you keep killing them. And so you just want to kind of keep switching it up, getting their guard off, and checking these back spawn areas, because that's the most important part of this map. If you don't check those, you're going to die. It's just a known fact. All right, and as you can see, I'm already 26 kills, 27 kills. I'm up, what? 12 kill, no, 14 kills now, and then I just get a little fight right there where he was hurt and I was able to kill him easily. And then right here, my self chopper takes out the uh, last guy. Uh, thanks for watching this first episode, guys. Uh, this is going to be a fun series for me to do. I cannot wait to keep doing this because I love playing free for all. It's just so much fun for me, and I'll get it more into like different class setups for different maps and later ones. I just know that for this one, you need a, a SMG with lots of firepower, preferably the MSMC. MP7, PDW, that kind of stuff. Anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like.